So, not too long ago, I passed the CompTIA Security Plus. And on the most recent video that I made about the Security Plus, someone in the comments section asked, can you do a video on what material you used to study? And just for them and everyone else that is planning to take this Security Plus, I'm making this video. I only used three things to study and pass the Security Plus. And the third one was the most useful and the most helpful for me. Now, the first thing I used was Professor Messer. Professor Messer has four courses on YouTube for completely free. And the courses are actually really, really good. Now, I didn't use the full course for my studies, kind of used it for areas which I needed to brush up on, certain areas I needed to fill in the gap. I would find a Professor Messer video on a certain piece of content or technology that I need to understand for the exam. But if you are starting from scratch, trying to get the Security Plus, I would recommend you going through Professor Messer's courses on the Sec Plus 701. It pretty much covers everything. Now, the second thing I used was the study resources for the PBQ. They are basically simulations of something you would be doing on the job as a cybersecurity professional. You will have a certain amount of PBQs on the exam. So it is important to learn and understand how to answer these performance-based questions. So I used this YouTube channel, Cybercraft. He has several PBQs on his channel and they were really helpful but when I got to the actual exam I did realize that a lot of the PBQs I saw in the exam were completely different to what I'd seen on the Cybercraft YouTube channel. Some were similar but there were some that I just yeah <laughs> did not see coming. So this was the resource that I used and it was helpful however keep looking for more pbq questions and simulations online because from the ones i went through anyway it didn't cover all of them but it covered some of them and he explained them really well so do check this out and do go after looking for other performance-based questions as well now the third and final resource that i used to pass this exam and the most useful of them all the comptia exam preparation app now i did actually pay for this app but it was only seven pounds for a week and in that week i went through so many questions now not only are the questions really good but the explanations after you miss a question or even if you get a question correct the explanations tell you so much about that question and if you study those explanations it's so helpful for when you get to that exam because in the explanation you're going to be learning things that have nothing to do with you know the question itself let's say you pick a wrong answer it's going to explain that wrong answer and when you get to another question that covers that answer, you'll understand it better based on getting it wrong the other time. I hope that makes sense. It has a section for all of your missed questions that you can go back to and run through. You can do 10 quick questions at any point in time, and you can also do mock exams, an exam simulation right here on the app. It's super helpful, and you can also go through each category of the Security Plus exam. So if you find out that you're kind of weak in one area, you can go through and focus on answering questions in that area and doing corrections and learning from that. Now, these are the materials that I use to pass the exam. And personally, I didn't need much more than this. However, it does depend on the position you're in. I'm someone who's worked in cybersecurity for a few years, so it would have been slightly easier for me to pick up certain things. There would have been things that I've worked on. And for that reason, this was all I needed. So depending on where you are, you may need some more resources or this may be enough. Regardless, make sure you're doing well on the mock exams and the exam simulations. If you continue to do well and get you know, close to that 80% regularly, that's when you start to understand that, yeah, I'm ready to take the actual exam. Leave a comment if you have any other resources that you're using to study for the exam or you used in the past, so that can help others as well. I also documented the whole process of me taking and passing the CompTIA Security Plus, so check out that video.